Hello, uh, we are students from the University of Tartu and we are tasting Estonian food. Big portion, please. <laughs> Hello, my name is Nazrin and I'm from Baku, Azerbaijan. My name is Nicole. I'm from Ecuador in South America. My name is Ayaz. I am from Azerbaijan, not Baku. Um, I'm very curious to start with the sausage. Um, I think I'll first try it without the jelly and then with the jelly. I don't know why it's blood, bloody sausage. Maybe it's from blood. <laughs> so it's really, really interesting because when you come to the Estonia and when you just like Google anything, you always find the blood sausage first and it's the first time I'm gonna eat it. It has some small pieces but I'm not sure what it is. It reminds me of soft nuts or I don't know what. Is, is this rice? I guess there is rice here. Very interesting flavor uh, with the salt and the sweet of the jelly. I think it's very, very tasty. <laughs> it's, uh, I cannot explain the taste because um, it's very mixed. Great stuff. This is mashed potatoes. I think it's bacon. Also very good. It's amazing. It's even much better than the smashed potatoes I have eat, ever eaten. This one is cabbage. I don't know what what this is like. Is it cabbage or uh, it looks also like maybe onion? I have never eaten something like that, but it's good. Yeah, I've seen it in the Christmas market, but it was like more mm, solid. But exactly this one I like very much. Well, uh, for these cold dishes, the most interesting thing I think it's uh, this kind of jello. Let's um, try it. Let's try this one. Fingers <laughs> cold. It's very salty. Mm. The texture also, it's very interesting. The, the softness of the jello and the fish that's like shredding. This is actually nice. I would never think about this kind of. Uh, food because usually uh, I've seen like sweet ones but not with fish so it's really interesting. I don't know if I would like try it or, like a bigger piece but I mean it's it's not it's not bad. It's chicken. Yeah maybe girls were raw. I think I would try it as raw fish. Mm. Mm, yeah. Raw fish. Mm -hmm. Let's not come. I'm, I'm a bit scared of trying uh, this, I think, raw fish. I've never had any raw fish, I think, except for like sushi, but it's not the same. With the sour cream, it tastes very good. I didn't expect it to be, to be so, so tasty. Soft also, the texture is quite pleasing to the tongue. It kind of melts, it's really good. This one reminds me of Russian salad or Olivier. Many people, many people have different names for it. We also have the something similar that one, but the, the how they make it is too close that we made at home. But that one is I don't know. It's I I guess it has like the more ingredient more different ingredients. Yeah, it's ham, and I've noticed that Estonians like putting ham in salads. I. I can't figure out what uh, ingredients, it's not, uh, I thought it was going to be like potato, but it's not, it doesn't feel like a potato, I don't know what, what it is, but it tastes good, I like it. For me, it's like the New Year wine, we make the salad when it is the New Year, so I love it. Maybe it's just because I'm used to it and I really like it, uh, by the way, it's my favorite salad. Ingredients are different, but still, my favorite one. Fried. Uh, fish. Mm, yeah, it's nice and it has. It's not just fried, fried, but it also has some kind of uh, like crispy bread or something which makes it crispier. So yeah, it's very delicious. Yeah, it's a uh, very common. I think uh, I'm used to that flavor, so I I really enjoy it. It's perfect. Perfect. I guess that one is like a casual meal in my country, so your mom would make it, I don't know, maybe once in a month or something like that, so it's not that much different for me. It's less 
a piece of bread that has some I'm thinking raw fish again an egg with onion Ah, uh, I know this one How? I have never eaten but when you go to the shop there's always one place you go there sandwich all the things one plastic like the big table and you sell boiled egg like the, this fish and uh, some special cream they, they like it's one table in one plastic package and they sell it like that it's, it's real cheap but I don't know why I have never bought it so it's the first time that I'm gonna taste and I have never eaten something like that previously. I am willing to try this again I think Really, really, really salty. So it reminds me of. Uh, I know that in like mostly Nordic countries, they have a lot of this kind of food. So most likely familiar with it, and I like it. It's nothing very, very special, but it's uh, t tastes nice. And cracker or chips. I don't know how to call it, but I think it also has dill. It's nice and tasty and maybe with sour cream it will be also good. Crisp. Of course I have eaten this because if you are student and if you are hungry it will help you a lot. Yeah, the same taste because I guess it has many tastes but that's the one I like the most. It has the, some greens on the packaging so you can just differentiate it. I just want to taste it with the sweet one so... <laughs> Not good idea, <laughs> but still it's okay. It's also very salty. I thought uh, it was going to be a bit more um, of a neutral flavor, but everything uh, so far has been very salty, so I am thinking that that's like a common thing with Estonian foods. But overall I have enjoyed it. It has been very tasty. <laughs>